Hello everyone, it's been a long time. How are you guys? Okay, so uh, today um, I plan to uh, create, uh, make new videos for a Linux tutorial so that I can share my knowledge with you guys on basic Linux. So first thing we need to do is we're gonna install the virtual box for our virtual machine where we can install uh, Linux OS, Linux operating system. Uh, we will use CentOS or Red Hat, it depends. Okay, so we can download virtual box in the website. Basically, we can. I'll share so just search Oracle virtual box this is a free software so you can use uh, install a new VM so we have a 6.1 version right now so when you click the link you can choose a Windows host if you're using Windows OS since I'm using Windows 10, I'm gonna click the host and basically it will uh, download the installer. So right now I'm done downloading the virtual box. It's gonna install. So double just double click it. Prompt you. Okay. Installation. So welcome to Oracle VM. So basically just Click next, next. If you want to create a shortcut, menu entries. Just click next, and then install. Um, actually, there are plenty of uh, virtual machines, uh, virtual VM softwares which you can use, which are free. I also have here a VM workstation this one I already have VMs on, on it okay so we're then installing the virtual box so first let's run the software so this is the movie first we're gonna install the new OS is uh, we're gonna install Sent OS 7. Let's see if it's still here. Yes, right now Sent Plus is it's out, is out of support or end of life already. So let's just put Red Hat 64 bit. So just click next. I'm just gonna give a one, one gig. You can have this, uh, you can have a bigger RAM if you want. If your uh, host computer has a big memory, then you can eventually uh, make uh, put higher uh, memory size. So I'll just put one gig. So I'll just create a virtual hard disk. Virtual this images. I think this is for virtual box. You can also choose which D or Vim DK, Vim DK file. So just set it in Italy. So you can expand your hard disk uh, later on. So I'm just gonna assign 8 gig. Okay, so here it is. Then. From here, I will look for the ISO file. Choose. And I will delete my ISO folder, so ISO 7. Choose. So when you start, Just 
the new installer. So, just click install send plus. Starting installer. So welcome to Send OS Seven. So you can choose what language do you want. They have plenty of language here. So you just choose English and you can choose your region. Region. It's in the Philippines, you can use Philippines. Click continue. Next, let's choose the uh, uh, installation destination. Just click this one, then click done. And then, it does all reset its time zone as Manila. The keyboard Filipino then just click begin installation you can set your root password from here so I'll just set my password this is the root this is a powerful uh, powerful user for Linux and you can also create here uh, Uh, user a local user while installing so let's see Joe what uh, just gonna use uh, username is JD Napo so JD Napo require password to use account make this user you can also make this as an admin we'll just give it as it is so I'll put my password so you can see if you put a more complex password it will uh, display a strong password but if you just put like simple password it's too short or weak like something like that so it's better to use a complex password for security okay so I already have a root password I created a local user and performing post installation setup test Wait. Okay, so now we're done. Now I just need to reboot the Linux OS. So it's rebooting now. Voila. We have our new VM, CentOS Linux 7 Core. So since we created a new user, we can like in using that user, so Linux.com, and we put our password. So this is uh, your environment for Linux CentOS 7. So. So that's it for the installation of the OS. So later on, I will upload more videos from basic uh, Linux config and commands and everything that I know. 
I'll try to share with you guys. So thank you for watching uh, my video. Uh, please like and subscribe. And I'll try to upload at least uh, three videos per week for the Linux tutorial. Okay. Thank you guys.